work with people with depression or anxiety. It's been the number one reason for visiting a doctor in Scotland since 2004. And uh, right now in Scotland, 14% um, of the population are on antidepressant medication. But the first five that we'll work on uh, is pretty basic, but I, I would say that probably 50% of the people I work with, they overcome their symptoms just by working on these five areas. Uh, so the first one is uh, hydration. Uh, what is it you're drinking? Because whatever you drink, directly affects how your brain performs. So caffeine and sugar uh, should be avoided because uh, research shows that they spike both depression and anxiety. Uh, second thing I always work on with a client is diet. Again, moving away from processed foods, moving away from sugary foods and focusing on 20 essential nutrients. So again, it's getting back to uh, natural foods like uh, vegetables and fruit and uh, eating healthy and having a very balanced diet. Uh, the third thing is sleep. Uh, sleep is such a major ingredient in how we perform mentally, physically, emotionally, socially. And so if you're an adult, you need between seven and nine hours sleep every 24 hours. Uh, if you struggle with sleep, if you have insomnia, uh, either getting off to sleep or waking up in the middle of the night with anxious thoughts, um, a great way to build up uh, your sleep in terms of quality and quantity. Um, some tips are to have a shower before you go to bed to relax yourself. 28 essential nutrients, I get clients to uh, take a multivitamin supplement that covers the 28 essential nutrients, plus has probiotics in it, which are very important probiotics, help your gut to produce the right uh, neurotransmitters and biochemicals to help regulate your mood, such as serotonin and dopamine, and 80% of serotonin is produced in the gut. And uh, so probiotic foods are very important. So a supplement would help you with that. And the last of the five is exercise. Research has shown that you can beat depression, you can outperform antidepressants by, by having a walk three times a week for 40 minutes. That's all you need to do. And that helps to boost the blood supply to your brain, to increase your oxygen supply and your nutrient supply.